Many of us know. Well, today, Congress recognized these many foot soldiers who made that historic march from Selma to Montgomery to help pass the 1965 Voting Rights Act. They were awarded the Congressional Gold Medal. This is a moment civil rights activists once thought impossible. They were called outside agitators, subversives, and other ugly names. In the Capitol building on Wednesday, leaders of the U.S. House and Senate awarded the Congressional Gold Medal to the foot soldiers who marched from Selma, Alabama to Montgomery in 1965. Hundreds of people participated in the demonstration, demanding voting rights for blacks. Police blocked and attacked many of them. We were beaten. We were trampled by horses. We were left bloody. Congressman John Lewis of Georgia helped lead the marches. He accepted the medal on behalf of foot soldiers across the country. It make, make all of the suffering, all of the pain worth it. The march expedited the passage of the Voting Rights Act of 1965. It's something that everyone at today's event talked about. It's just a blessing. Reverend Frederick Reese, a civil rights giant, organized the march and invited Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. to join. Reese says decades later, the real reward is equality. To allow all people, regardless of their race, creed, or color, to enjoy the blessings that can come from being represented. The Congressional Gold Medal is the highest civilian honor. Many of the recipients attended the ceremony as Congress and the country pause to say thank you. And just as their efforts to pass Voting, Ra voting Rights Act were shared with everyone, this gold medal will be shared with everyone as well. They plan to store it in a museum in Selma.